Lee, another good pre-season outing here at Hawley Town today. Yeah, really good. Um, second half especially, I thought we were um, very dominant with the ball and um, and without it, we worked very hard to get after the opposition. Uh, we were a bit disappointed in the first half performance, to be honest. So, um, you know, we didn't move the ball quick enough. The pitch was very sticky, very good pitch here, but very sticky today. And um, we didn't quite get to grips with it in the first half. But second half, very good, some really good goals and excellent attribute from from the try list. Um, <laughs> and um, yeah, and for me, it was uh, a well worth exercise today. And it was an early hurdle to get over. Obviously, Hawley took the lead only minutes in. Yeah, sloppy bit of play from us. Um, got down the sides of us and we had a runner off the back of us and, and he scored off in off the post, I think it went. So I think that was a bit of a livener for the boys to think this ain't going to be you know, what they thought it was. And we spoke to them before the game saying these games are always difficult because you've got, to, you've got to get up for it. You've got to make sure that you're doing what you, you can to get in the gap of Zyland, to get in the team come three or four weeks' time. And um, you know, that was a bit of a shock, I think, for the boys early doors. I don't think trialists could have done much more today. A really impressive performance, and that second half especially looked really, really sharp. Yeah, excellent. I thought um, well, all three goals were fantastic finishes, top corners, and good header um, in off the post. And you know, but I thought all over the pitch in the second half we looked much brighter, much more energetic, cuter, and cleverer with the ball. And um, I think that was what ultimately got us the six goals and five goals in the second half. Um, and uh, yeah, it went on from there really. So. Um, no, it was four goals, wasn't it? Because Trilis had a hat trick as Sam Matthews scored. No, Tyler yeah. scored, did he? No, that was ruled out. So, Take that yeah, four in the second half. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> had you. <laughs> I mean, it's always nice to score six goals in the game, even if it is a pre season friendly like today. Of course, it's good habits. And ultimately, today is about um, having good habits, working hard, um, getting um, all the sort of things we've been speaking about in training and doing in training, the little patterns of play out. Um, but ultimately, coming out of it injury free. Um, which we have picked up one in Jordan Tunnicliffe with a looks like a broken nose, so that's a bit of a disappointment after an operation in the summer. But um, yeah, we had some good lads out there today, and I think young Calm coming on, he's 16 years old, at, you know, come out of the academy. Joe Ogilvie as well coming on at the end. You know, it's good that the boys are getting some experience around the first time. And it was lovely, well, for yourself and for the rest of the lads to see a lot of the fans travelling down today to see the game. Yeah, it's nice to see people stood around the pitch again, you know. And um, the chat with a few of the fans around the outside, and that is um, is nice to see. And uh, you know, without people stood around with masks on and uh, getting behind the boys again, so we're looking forward to, to the season for that reason as well, to get the fans back in, and uh, they can make a difference, and they have done in the past. So um, we're looking forward to that. Thanks, Lee. Cheers, lads. Cheers, mate. Sam, our second pre-season game here at Hawley, and a good result. Yeah, it was good. Obviously, it's nice to um, all the boys to get a few goals and surface wasn't easy so um, it's important that we had the right attitude and, and came in sort of applied you know the right things and you know, in the end I think it was a pretty good performance and everyone's got some more minutes and you know still early days in pre-season so yeah you know good bit of work. And coming back to pre-season obviously some some time off a lot of running but how have you been finding year two at Crawley? Yeah no it's been good it's been a good start um, it's nice to come back in things feel a little bit normal this like more normal this year than obviously last year with with Covid and, and stuff like that so yeah I feel like everyone's in good spirits and you know the boys have come back fit and in good shape so you know, we've got plenty of time now to really build up for you know hopefully it'll be a, a positive start to the season and you must be in well a bit of a different state of mind i suppose with such a long pre-season this time compared to last time out yeah exactly obviously last year it was a bit of a quick turnaround and we didn't have much opportunity to play many pre-season games so you know you do have a, a bit more time now as a player to really you know build into things and you know we can get more work in, in training so you know we've got a good sort of lineup of pre-season you know fixtures to come now um so i think all the boys are looking forward to building up their minutes and you know building up towards the season I think we really picked up on as well at Walton the relationship between yourself and especially Tom Nichols on the pitch and today it was exactly the same, some really, really nice combination play. Yeah, I think all over the pitch we're getting those partnerships. Obviously, you know, the more that we develop understanding between players and between you know the system that we're playing, um, you know, everyone sort of reacts off each other. So whether that's me and Tom or full backs and, and centre midfielders, you know, everyone's kind of linking in which is which is nice and hopefully that'll put us in good stead towards, you know, playing, you know, the games that are gonna be coming up. And it was a proper electric second half performance, a goal for yourself as well. Yeah, yeah, no, nice. So obviously um, trying to get as many shots off as possible really. And yeah, I felt like we pinned them in and had a lot of chances second half there. So, um, you know, Alex you know, took some great finishes himself. So, yeah, no, we're in a, hopefully we're in a good position. Um, but it's early days, we've got to keep working really and keep sort of fine tuning things. And, you know, like I said, we're relatively early on in pre-season really. We've got plenty of games ahead. And a slightly longer grass today, but it was good to see yourself running at people, cutting inside and, and trying to get those shots away. Yeah, it was, it was testing. Um, it took five or ten minutes to get used to it, I think, for the boys. But 
yeah, that's just part of pre-season, to be fair. You're going to go to different places, you're going to come up against different types of opposition, different pitches. Obviously, we were on uh, 4G the other, the other night, uh, on Tuesday night. So, yeah, it's just about adapting. And like I said, that's where attitude comes into it, really. And I think if you come into the game with the right intensity, um, no no disrespect to these, you know, they, they did well, but we, we should be at a better level and, you know, we should be scoring goals and creating chances. Cheers. Cool, cheers. Thanks.